sustainability. It's very important for the aviation industry and IATA has established a net zero uh, target for 2050. Copa Airlines uh, has endorsed that same IATA target. Uh, so we're striving towards uh, net zero emissions in 2050. Uh, however, I must say that airlines are only one piece of the aviation industry. Uh, we have to also include the fuel producers, the airplane manufacturers, the engine manufacturers, uh, the airport and airspace operators. We're all in the same game. So this can only be accomplished by all the parties working together, including the political side. So if airlines carry the full weight, we're not gonna get as far as we need to. After uh, three uh, difficult years, as we know, after the pandemic, uh, Copa Airlines closed 2022 at very similar revenues, in, uh, very similar levels in terms of revenues and, and passengers and capacity as 2019. Uh, this year, we're already above 2019, so we're above pre-pandemic in number of flights, capacity, revenues, and we're expecting uh, for demand to remain strong in Latin America. Uh, we have uh, many Boeing 737 MAX aircraft on order and, and we hope to continue growing and developing and strengthening our hub of the Americas, our leading hub of the Americas in Panama in the next number of years.